Hi guys, welcome here again to another news. It has just been reported that the Nigerian Air Force Jets bombarded the camp of ISWAP leader Fiabaya Yuram in Sambisa and the killed terrorists. They bombarded the camp of the ISWAP leader and they were able to successfully kill terrorists. Well, we would like you to sit tight as we go into the full details to know actually where this incident happened. The Nigerian Air Force jet bombarding the camp of the ISWAP leader Fia Baya Yuram in Sambisa, not just attacking but also killing terrorists, according to what has been reported. Scores of high profile Islamic states in West Africa province ISWAP terrorists were killed by Nigerian Air Force and AF military jets at the enclave of Fiaba Yuram in Sambisa Forest over the weekend. According to PR Nigeria, Fiaba Yuram, a notorious terrorist, is the current leader of ISWAP in Sambisa Forest in Bono, northeastern Nigeria. He took over the leadership of the ISWAP insurgent group following the killing of Boko Haram leader Ababaka Shikao last year. The raid at the ISWAP leader's enclave followed a credible and actionable intelligence by the hair component of Operation of Handikai, which revealed that terrorists were gathering for an undisclosed mission. An intelligence military source said airstrikes were then authorized and launched on the location following the intelligence. He said an assessment of the location after the strikes revealed it to be successful, though it remained unconfirmed if Fia Bajuram was among the terrorists neutralized in the strikes. Meanwhile, similar airstrikes were also launched on Tonbon near Lake Chad after suspected terrorist activists were observed in the area believed to be a training camp for you know ISWAP fighters. Pierre Nigeria also gathered from another military intelligence officer. The targets were subsequently acquired and engulfed in flames all after. The aftermath of the airstrike revealed that pandemonium broke out at the remnants, you know, as the remnants pardon, of the surviving terrorists took cover under nearby trees, which were later struck by the aircraft, the officer disclosed. The Nigerian Air Force Director of Public Relations and Information, Air Commander Edward Gapquet confirmed the strikes to PR Nigeria, saying, yes, strikes were carried out on some specific targets in the Tonbon and Sambisa with varying degrees of successes recorded. The Nigeria Air Force won't, however, be drawn into the details of those neutralized. What is your thought to this? What is your own reaction to this plan development? Well, congratulations to the Nigerian Air Force for them being able to successfully neutralize at least some of the terrorists at the Sambisa Forest. Now, according to reports, Sambisa Forest has been, you know, raided by the Nigerian Air Force using their jets to bombard the camp of the ISWAP leader in Sambisa and kill terrorists. Though the details of the neutralized terrorists were not disclosed, but it is obvious that they were able to neutralize some of them. What is your thought to this? Do you think with this success it will drastically reduce the forces of the ISWAP in most of these northern states because we've heard about their activities in almost all the northern states, most especially Bono states and a lot of steps has been carried 
you know sort of trust strategy you know strategy pardon has been put in place by the government of nigeria in order to get rid of these people but has been proven abortive but congratulations to the nigerian air force who were able to at least do something about these terrorists who have been terrorizing our nation who would like you to let us know your own thoughts they would like you to let us know your own reaction to this that has been said but before we go let's people's reactions to this of course most people will not want to believe this you know incident that has happened because there is no you know evidence to prove that this really happened though the commando do confirmed the incident but there was no picture no video so you know really ascertain what you know they are they have been saying that this thing really happened but we know that of course it will happen because really the nigerian government are trying their best though it has been proven abortive but for this that has happened i think you know nigerian government you know are trying to get rid of this bandit well let's see what people have felt to this Ido Wutaiwu reacted to this and said so why is it that in the picture we are seeing it is the headsmen and Soludo that are being graded together there why does this mean Soludo is the commander of the air force while the headsmen are eye swap what is your thought to this that is what has been said by Ido Wutaiwu saying that what is the usefulness of Chasolido's picture, that is, the governor of Adamawa State, and the headsmen we are looking at, this ought not to be. AZ also reacted and said, this is full confusion everywhere. You know, looking at what I'm seeing presently now, I can see the governor of Anambra State and headsmen being graded together you know with a caption that the nigerian air force jets bombarded in the camp of iswa Plera in sambisa killing terrorists and now people are you know being aggravated by this you know greeting of pictures because probably it doesn't really correlate with the headlines what is your thought to this people believe that there is so much confusion in nigeria and even if what has been confirmed by the commando is even true because for you to have done this we don't even really trust you what is your thought to this what is your own reaction we would like you to let us know your own point of view to this if you are new to this channel please do like share comment and don't forget to turn on the bell icon to get you notified anytime we post a new update and also a big shout out to our the subscribers i want to say a big thank you to you for liking sharing and commenting and want to employ you to continue to do so Thank you guys for listening and I'll see you on the other news. Bye for now.